Hi folks, it's your boy Brady and we're back for another snacking thing. Yeah, yeah, we're really excited. You're here for this one. He usually doesn't get to be in these things. Bird Mom did not want to participate in this video. I wonder why. I, I don't know. So I decided I wanted to try something that I've been wanting to try for like a long time, but never really took the steps to make that happen. I wanted to try crickets. So I got these little guys here, Cricket Bites, Roasted Original Crickets, which that's an interesting little thing. Let me just show you here. Um, so I thought this would be a good little entry level way of trying eating bugs. <laughs> Cause like eating bugs is something that a lot of cultures do, but in the United States, we're not really huge into that, but there are plenty of places that eat bugs. They eat crickets, they eat various other insects because the, there's a lot of benefit to it. They're often very high in like protein, fiber, various nutrients and whatever. So, uh, Crickets by many are considered to be sort of a superfood, even though I, I don't know the whole term superfood feels sort of pseudoscience-y. But either way, like it's a it's considered to be like a pretty interesting thing. And I and this is like I don't know if this is like the equivalent of eating chips as far as eating bugs goes, but I'm getting this like pre-packaged roasted original whole roasted crickets I, I, I don't know I, I I wonder why bird mom didn't want to do this she's not really big into the creepy crawlies the creepy crawlies make her uncomfortable um, I feel like I might handle this okay I come from a place where seafood is huge um, it's very important in Rhode Island we're, we're big into our seafood and a lot of things that we eat that come from the ocean are kind of just like ocean versions of creepy crawlies so like uh, what separates a shrimp from an ordinary bug am i right um so this uh this is what the i don't know if it's gonna focus doesn't seem like it wants to i shouldn't have used this camera uh it's got like Oh, there we go. It's got like the head and everything. It still looks sort of like a cricket. It doesn't have, uh, doesn't seem to have its legs on it anymore. Okay. Refocus. Refocus. Don't trust the autofocus, guys. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, we'll, we'll let it figure itself out. Maybe if I, there we go. <laughs> um, photo booth. Am I right? <laughs> So you don't want this. I, I don't think, I don't know if you can eat this. Um, may, maybe you probably can, but I'm not going to take the risk without asking Bird Mom if it's okay. So I'm going to try this and we're going to see how I feel about it. Hmm. Okay, this is an interesting experience. I want to try one more. I have, I have thoughts. So the form that these are in is interesting because they're very dry. Be being roasted like this, they're very much dehydrated. I'm sure there are other ways of having them. I guess with these, I would say they're... Uh, ooh, they, they got kind of a flakiness, a dry flakiness to them. I could see how that could turn some people off. I'm not opposed to it. But I would have it with a drink. Speaking of which... <laughs> gotta get my water in so i would say that as far as snacks go it it's not it doesn't feel weird it doesn't feel like a creepy crawly or whatever it oh you want to play with your bell very good so it doesn't feel like a weird creepy crawly thing it just feels like you ever have like popcorn and they have like the little they have the kernel, but then they have the little flakes of the kernel that will come off. Honestly, it's a little like eating those little, little kernel flakes that come off of it. That, that, that little outer layer of the shell. I'm going to keep going at this. And uh, this company, the, the Cricket Bites people, they do have 
other flavors. I think, hold on, let, let me, uh, let me look that up and I will let you know how it sounds. Cause, uh, I think these, these are very plain. I went for a very plain experience cause I thought that would be a good first experience. I will fight you. I will fight you if you keep screaming. Um, they have buffalo wing sauce, cheesy ranch, hickory smoked, um, bacon, spicy cayenne. Yeah, any of these would be lovely with this. This is actually a very good experience overall. I'm sorry it keeps auto-focusing all weird. Like, I, I haven't used this camera in a long time. Um, so I would like to get into trying things like this. There's the personal benefit of them being very high in protein for how little they are. These are rather uh, little bites we got going on here. So with something like that, I hear the argument that if we went to eating bugs instead of eating like cows or whatever, which cows are a big contributor to uh, global warming and climate change or whatever because they uh, uh i i believe it's their farts or their burps or whatever i i don't remember exactly what the reason for it is but they're also not the most efficient things to care for they require a lot of water to care for they require a lot of resources going into them to produce and such a high level i i, I am curious about how if there was demand for it, if we could efficiently uh, produce enough crickets to feed the type of demand that there is for uh, for beef. Because the beef industry, as it is now, is, uh, <clears throat> is kind of a monster. And I say that as somebody who loves beef, who loves eating burgers or whatever, but... Uh, I, I'm all, it's also one of those things that I'd sort of be willing to let go. Um, I have just never taken that step and m maybe I should, I don't know. It's one of those things where, you know, something it, it'd probably be, be better for, Hey, Hey, I'm going to eat you next. <laughs> there you go. It, it'd probably be something that's better for my health <laughs> to not have so much like red meat or whatever. And it would probably be like better in general if people didn't have so much because of uh, the both environmental cost and health cost of the nation. We, we have a, we're a very unhealthy nation, but I don't know. But uh, crickets, I'm open to. <laughs> I, I am open to. This, this is my first step into that. I might get more of these, but the plain ones, they're, they're just that. They're plain. They, they're just a texture, but they're a tolerable texture. So I could see this being a nice uh, go between between me and my buffalo sauce or whatever other flavor I end up getting. I could put, I could like put these in something. I I, I don't have to have them as they are here. I I could like uh, I I could like put some sauce out and like dip my little guys in them. That that would be fine. So yeah. I, I give this one uh, a, a, an enthusiastic thumbs up as sort of like a decent way to deliver the nutrients that could probably be improved by uh, adding any sort of flavor. So maybe next time I'll try some flavors because uh, I'm down with that. That's pretty cool. All right. Thank you for watching this random video. All right. Oh, yeah. If you want to buy these, I'll put a link in the description box below or whatever. Bye. <laughs>